I'm going to show you how to pair or connect a Xbox controller, the Series S or the Series X, directly to your Hisense Smart TV and Android TV via wireless Bluetooth. Okay, so very simple here. So the first thing we got to do is go to the settings on your TV here. So I'm going to click on the home button on my remote. And then from here, you want to go to the settings, the gear icon. So we're going to go up, up, and then go all the way to the right, 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 right gear icon settings click on ok on the remote from here we're going to go down to the very bottom where it says remotes and accessories right there click on ok now it says add accessory we're going to click on that now it's looking for bluetooth devices now go ahead and grab your xbox controller x or s series first thing we're going to do is turn it on so let me just turn the remote on hold it for a couple seconds and now now it's blinking now we're going to press and hold the share button here okay ready set go just press and hold and just wait until this light here starts blinking rapidly okay now what we got to do is wait here hopefully it finds it if you're here too long what you can do is try this okay I'm gonna go and click on the back button on my remote and it's in pairing mode you can see it blinking rapidly let me just go back Ooh, let me click on back button here let me go back here. Let me go back to accessory. It's still in pairing mode. So I'm going to go add accessory again. And voila, now it just finds it really fast. Xbox wireless controller. So let me grab my remote. Let me click on OK right there. It says pairing now. Give us one second. Now it says connecting up there. Now it says paired. All right. So now we should be paired connect it okay and we see it like a solid white light on here okay now we can go ahead and move around if I want to go back I click on the B click on the back again back and then I can go ahead and if I want to select something like if I want to go to the settings and select it I just tap on the A select it A go back letter B okay pretty simple